Jesus. He calls himself the Lord of the Sabbath. Okay. So this verse is called, uh, is equated to Jesus Christ, the Father and Holy Spirit. All right, can I speak now? Go on. So you believe that Jesus is God, yes? The Father, the Son and Holy Spirit, they share the same nature the and same essence. Yes, Jesus is God. I'm talking about Jesus. Yes. So you believe Jesus is God, yes? Yes, yes. Right. If Jesus was God, then how come have you got no problem with English? Yes. Pardon? You have no problem with English. Yes. Yes. You understand? I can read English, English as man. So when Jesus said, "The Lord, our God, is one," mm. in Mark twelve twenty nine, yes. Jesus said, "The Lord, our God." Jesus didn't say, "The Lord, your God." Jesus said, "The Lord, our God," mm. meaning the God of the people he was speaking to, and his. So, yes. That's why Jesus said, the Lord, our God Because I'll one. explain to you, because Jesus no. Christ was fully God and fully man. Okay, fully in, hum man. in his human nature, he was okay. in submission to the Father, okay. as well as to the Holy Spirit okay. and himself. Did you say Jesus was in submission to God the Father? Yes, because he was here to represent mankind. So, so Jesus Christ is not going to be an atheist on earth. So tell He's me. going to live by the rules that we follow. Because so, so, we submit to God, of course, Jesus is going to do the same thing. Okay, Submitting so, to God. Okay, so Jesus was... In, Submitting to the Father, the Son and Holy Spirit okay, is the same. Okay, so Jesus was in submission to God the Father, yes? God the Father, the Holy Spirit and Himself. So are you saying Jesus was in submission to God the Father to God the Son and to the Holy Spirit. So, all okay, so what is it in First John? It says, can, Brother, Jesus was listen, listen to this. To this. I'll explain to you. In First John, it says, The will of the Father, the, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, these three agree. So we can see their will is one. Okay. So when Jesus Christ was praying to the Father, when he was submitting to his will, okay. it is the same as submitting to himself in his divine nature, the Holy Spirit, and the Father. Did there you, you go. Did you say that Jesus prayed to his Father? He, okay, so. Because Jesus Islam Christ, is a copy of okay, brother, let me explain to you. Let me explain to you. Uncle, uncle, uh, uncle, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay. Are we from Adam and Eve? Uncle, please. Are we from Adam and Eve? Uncle, please. Because, yeah, Uzman, uncle, uncle, I'm a Christian. I'm a Christian. I'm Christian. Uncle, take him over there. I was supposed to forget them. Forget them. Because Jesus. Excuse me. It's Christian. Osman, are you going to talk? Just don't listen. Uh, okay, listen. Tell him to he's, 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 This is speaker's corner. They can stand where they want. You talk to me. Excuse you ignore me. them. Excuse me. Why don't you talk over there? We are speaking. Okay. okay. Because Jesus Christ was eternally had a relationship with God the Father and God the Holy Spirit. So, of course, he's going to pray to the Father. Of course, he's going to communicate to the Father through the Spirit. So, so what did you, Jesus say in John 17 verse 5? So, so Father, glorify me with the glory that I had with you before the world before the world began so jesus christ was here before the world began and he had a relationship with the father and holy spirit okay, which is why okay. jesus christ communicated and prayed to the father do you you still say jesus prayed to the father yes so when you say jesus prayed to the father in his humanity listen when you say jesus prayed to the father you are telling us that jesus prayed to god Yes, so he communicated yes. and prayed to the first member of the Trinity, which is the Father, so through saying, the Holy Spirit. Okay, so through you, the Holy Spirit. So are you saying God Jesus prayed to God the Father? Okay, so the the man I say the, the man Jesus Christ, the man Paul, Amen. the Apostle Paul refers to Jesus Christ as the man Jesus Christ. So the humanity, the human nature of Jesus Christ was limited. So he was communicating and praying to the Father. But Jesus also told us in John 14, verse 14. If you ask me anything in my name, I will do it. And okay. you cannot say that about Muhammad because that okay. would be shirk. So me, Jesus Christ is telling us to pray to him. Tell me, did God the Father at any time pray yes. to Jesus God the Father? Yes, Christ? I will show you in the book oh, of Hebrews. He praised him. He praised him and gave him glory. I said prayed, P -R -A -Y -E -D. P-R-A-Y-E-D. It's different to pray. Yeah, understand. Do you know English? I will show you, my friend. P-R-A-I-S. My friend, he does not... Something Jesus Christ like? only prayed because he was limited. He was in his humanity, in his divine nature. He never prayed. Okay. He was communicating with okay. the Father before okay. times began. Did you but when he came on earth in his humanity, that's when he prayed. Did you say the power of Jesus was limited? The power of Jesus Christ. Was the power of Jesus limited? 
So when Jesus Christ came on earth, yes. he ruled his glory, he ruled his attributes. He did not use them to his own advantage, so but rather on, only when his would, was ruled within the Godhead, that's when he would use it. So on earth, are you trying to tell us, when Jesus was on earth, his power was limited? He, he, he ruled them, he set them aside. He did not use them for his own glory or to his own advantage. But so rather, only when he needed to, okay. only when it was ruled within the Godhead, then he used it. Okay, was Jesus always God? Okay, so when, he, when, we, when we say God, we mean his nature, all right? You're a human being because you're your nature. We're not talking about your attributes. Jesus Christ was fully God because of his nature. We're not talking about his attributes, all right? Okay. In his nature, he was fully God and fully man. The human nature which is what made him so human when, as well. So when Mary gave birth to Jesus, yes. Did Mary give birth to Jesus who was fully God? Okay, so as you can see, I'll ask you, ask you in the, what does it say? In the beginning was the Word, the Word was with God, then the Word, um, and the Word was God, and the Word became flesh. The so the, the Logos of Christ became flesh. Answer the and the question. Logos went into the womb of Mary, okay, and then came into the world. The so he was fully God and fully man. What so made him fully God was his spirit. So he had the divine spirit okay. into the human flesh. Okay. That's where we see fully God hold and on, fully man. So when, when Jesus was inside his mother, yes, was he still God? Okay, so when Jesus Christ was in the womb of Mary, the Logos, he came into the womb, right? But his divine spirit, which was, was God there? his divine spirit was always there and always here. What so his Jesus? divine spirit was inside the flesh, so, inside the human tissue, so which you, made him fully God and fully man. So are you saying when Jesus was inside his mother, yes. at that time he was God, yes? He was fully, his, so his full glory was willed, but his spirit, so he was the divine God. spirit was inside the human tissue. Like the way how you put on your clothes, you know, the way how you put on a jacket. Make it simple. Okay, I'll explain to you the way how you put on a jacket, the way how God took on human tissue. He wore the flesh so and his spirit manifested in that human tissue. Let's make it simple, yes or no. You don't like the answer. Inside, he doesn't like the answer. Inside Mary, huh? when Jesus was, I when, gave you the clear when, answer. When Jesus was inside Mary, was he God, yes or no? Okay, I have told you. When Jesus Christ the Logos came, right, manifested for human tissue, his divine, not his full glory, but his spirit, the divine spirit of Christ dwelt within the bodily form, which is why we say in Colossians chapter 2 verse 9, for in Christ all the fullness of deity lives in bodily form. What makes him fully God was his spirit, the divine nature. So when Jesus came from his mother, okay, when Jesus came from his mother mm. into the world, are you, yeah, when Jesus came into the world, yes. at the time of his birth, yes. was that God who came out into the world? Okay, so we can see what did it, the, the three wise men, what did they do to Jesus? They worshipped him. The Magi, they worshipped Jesus. So we can see from that verse, Jesus Christ was fully God and fully man. So when, when we see... When we no, say no. fully God, we do not mean in his full glory, he ruled his glory. Okay. But a spirit of God would dwell within the human tissue of Jesus Christ. So you are telling us, thank you for that. So you are telling us, even on earth, Jesus at that time when he was a man, he was still fully God, yes? He was God, yes. And God's spirit can be there and here at the same time right. when he okay. wants to. Okay. Yes. Okay, right. Let him but let me God. ask him questions okay. because he's okay. asked, asked me so many questions. But you're not allowed to ask you any questions. I want to ask you a question now. No, no, no. I've answered like 10 questions. I've answered like 10 questions of this. Hey, listen. You asked me to speak to you. I'm speaking to you. But I want to ask you a question. Let's carry on. He's nothing without this guy. Let's carry on. Are you scared of this? I've asked him like 10 questions. Okay, let's carry on. Let's carry on. Do you pray to God? We pray the doxoloxy formula, the Father, through the Son in the Spirit. Whether you pray to the Father, those who have seen the Son have seen the Father. Those who have seen the Son have seen the Father. What does that tell you? They are the same. They are the same nature and same essence. So whether you pray to the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit, it does not matter because they share the same nature and glory. The question I asked was, do you pray to God? Yes? Yes. Right. Now, did Jesus pray to God? He was communicating because he had an eternal relationship with God the Father and the Holy Spirit, which we see okay. in the book of Genesis. 
He was on earth. He's not going to be an atheist on earth, is he? So he was communicating and praying to the Father through the Spirit. So you agree? Yes. Why do you have to speak, man? Let me speak. One to one. One to one. So you agree that Jesus did pray? Yes, because he was here to represent mankind, to set an example of how to pray. Which is why he prayed to the man. Okay. But you prayed to Muhammad as well, but you don't realize no, it. Don't. And when you go on the Kaaba, no, no. that's this that's an occultish move. And who does Allah pray to? Can you stop? Can you stop? I've answered your questions, man. Okay. You don't let me speak, man. Okay. Can you stop? You are making a mistake. You said we pray to Muhammad. No, we only pray to Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala. So what does this mean? What does that mean? But he, doing your salah is only meant to be communication with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So you are associating Muhammad with Allah, which is shirk and idolatry. No. Yes. Yes. No. Okay, brothers. I used to say that as well. When I came to the truth, you opened my heart. You opened my eyes to the truth. I worship the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, which is the truth. Okay. Okay. I'm talking to him. I'm talking to him. Okay. You watch that. You kiss the stone, brother. Okay. Okay. No, no, no. You worship a man. Come on. You worship You worship Muhammad as well. Come on. You worship idols. You worship idols. Okay. Okay. Ask your question then. Okay. One more question, man. That's it. One more question. No, no, no. no. I've answered so many on. of your questions. I'm Hold not a dimmy here. Hold on. Yes. Man, I'm not Hold a dimmy on. here. I'm not your doormat. We must. You're nothing without a fold of the man. Come on. We must. Why you scared? Without your script. You're nothing without your script. Yes. Yeah. You Ask mind your business. Yeah. 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 Answer you my need question. To close your mouth. Okay. Let Answer me. my question. Okay. No, it's a behavior. Behavior. Let me ask you a question. No, no. I'm going to ask you a question. I'm going to ask you a question. Okay. 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 It's my. Okay. I've answered ten okay. of your questions. Okay. No, 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 no. It's my time. It's my time. It's my time. It's my time. Okay, old man. Jesus, 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 Jesus. Answer my question. Answer my question. Old man, answer my question. He's running away. Takia. That's it. In the book of John, chapter five. Answer my question! I've got it, man. I've got it. All right, it's Sahih Bukhari 5765. It says, Magic was work on our less messenger. Why do you trust the black? Why do you trust a man who's possessed by black magic? Why do you trust a man who's possessed by black magic? Why do you trust a man who's possessed by black magic? I've answered it. I've answered it. In your Bible. No, no, let me speak. In your Bible. No, no, let me speak. In Sahih Bukhari 5765, magic was work. Oh, oh, How can you trust a man who was possessed by black magic? How can you trust a man who tried to commit suicide and he was bewitched by a demon? Please answer it. Who does Allah pray to in Surah 2157? Who is Allah praying to? Your God prays in Surah 2157. It says Allah sends his salawat, which means salah. That means prayer. So who is Allah praying to? What does the sal no, he, he doesn't answer my question. I, ask, I answered it. Watch, watch the video. I answered all his questions. He has not answered any of mine. Did not answer any of mine. <laughs> uh, that's it. Close 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 it. All right. As you can see, like, bro, I've answered twenty of his questions. I've answered so many of his questions, man. Listen. Give the Muslim a chance. Don't give him a chance, man. Give him some chances. Make him speak. Thank you. We Muslims. Believe in our holy Quran. Whatever he, he is he enough. Oh, be quiet! You foolish! Yeah. You, you foolish! You acting like a dog! Close it! 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 Close it!
I'm asking this question. Oh, what's, one more question. One more question, man. Stay. Stay. Make him speak. I've got my phone. Okay, yeah. okay thank you. Okay, thank you. Okay. We Muslims, we believe in our Holy Quran. Everything in our Holy Quran, we believe. As a Christian, do you believe everything which is in your Bible? Yes or no? Okay, can I please explain to you my answer? So now your script is going to be, the Roman Catholic has this many books, the Greek Orthodox has this many books. But what you don't realize is we have 66 books that is enough to prove the doctrine of Jesus Christ. And the, cru the crucifixion and resurrection of Christ, this is a historical fact. Okay, stop. And going back to your Quran, the, stop. the goat ate your manuscript, stop. Uthman burnt your manuscript. Stop. In one Quran, you, you, had, in, in one Quran, in one Quran, you had 114 surahs. In another Quran, you had 111 surahs. You don't have your manuscripts. You don't have your manuscripts. Yeah. Okay. This Christian lied to you. He said, I was going to tell you a different number of books in the Bible. No. I, you be quiet, you liar. Don't tell my problem. Okay? Shut we love out. Muhammad. Okay. We pray for him. Okay. And I pray God forgives him okay. for his sins. Okay, listen. Listen. No, he's dead. Listen. Yeah, your God died. Yeah? Dead, dead. No, the died. man Jesus your Christ. Your God died. The man oh, Jesus Christ. Christ. The man Jesus Christ. Why so many Christians? For he is risen! Yeah. He is risen! Yeah. Indeed, he is risen! Yeah. He is risen! Yeah. He is risen. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I asked him 20 years ago. No, don't show you that. He's holy. I'll be quiet, you look. Okay. Give me a chance. I've got a good note. Okay. I said we Muslim believe everything in our Holy Quran. And do you as a Christian believe everything yes. in your Bible? We believe the Bible is the word of God, which the Quran confirms. Okay. The Injil and the Torah okay. is the word of God, which okay. cannot be corrupted okay. in Surah 6, 1, 1, 5. Okay. So if you are to say the okay. Bible is corrupted, you are being a okay. heretic Stop. right there. Let him explain. Stop. You are okay. committing a heresy I right there. I have a question. He's answered it. So yeah. Yeah. He's answered it. I've answered yes. 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 your question. I know it's good. Let's just say yes so you can move. You are barking, you dog. Come on. So why is he barking? Come on, man. Leave it, leave it. I'm speaking. So when he says I'm barking, let him speak. Let him speak. Yeah, so don't use that word. Hey, that's it. Stop barking. Okay. I said you are a dog. You are barking. Stop 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 barking. So we Muslims believe everything in our oh Holy Quran. According to this Christian, they believe what's in their Bible. Okay, let me read to you a verse from the Bible. Okay. In our Christian Bible. Amen. I know he's going to go to he's going to go to Paul. You're going to go to Paul, right? Are you a Christian? Go on, bring it on. So one Muslim, so many Christians speaking, have some manners. Okay. No, no, that's fine, that's fine. Okay. Have some manners. Go on, bring it up, man. In every Aye. Christian Bible, the in, the, in the Gospel according to Luke, chapter 22, yep. verse 41, yep. in the Bible it says, Jesus, he knelt down oh my and prayed. Yeah, okay, let me answer. So, listen, listen. Hindu kneel down. Okay. 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 Hindu kneel down. Hindu kneel down. Hindu kneel down. Hindu kneel down. The reason why Jesus Christ prayed, because he's fully God and fully man, he was limited in his humanity, okay. which is why he communicated and prayed to the Father. So, so he won't let me speak. He won't let me speak. Hey, hey, he won't, hey, hey, hey. So when, so when Jesus, so are you be quiet? Okay, so, I'm gonna speak now because you're not letting me speak. No, no, the reason why speak. Jesus Christ prayed because he was made like us. He's not gonna be an atheist oh, on earth, is he? And because he had a relationship yes. with the Father before the world began, that's the reason why he prayed 
no. because he was made like us. He's not ah, going to be an atheist, so is he? Like yes. Hey, so, yeah. To so, represent so, mankind hey, hey, because no hey, man hey, can hey, be stop, the perfect example stop, of mankind. Stop, stop, First Adam stop, came in and left the tin. Okay, stop, stop, Jesus Christ was our substitute. Stop, so by him, he can redeem us and we can enter the kingdom of heaven. Are you being quiet? Yes. Thank you. But in that oh, context, started, when Jesus stop, knelt down, stop, what's the context of that prayer? Stop, no, 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 no. When Jesus, when Jesus, when Jesus prayed in the Garden of Gethsemane, what's the context behind that? Why did he pray? What was he praying for? What's the cup of death? Answer me, was man. He's not answering my question. I want five answers. What's the cup of death? What's the context behind the Garden of Gethsemane? Okay. Yeah. I get you. Doesn't let me speak. Thank you. Let's hear the rubbish. This Christian, I'm going to give a verse from the Bible. Christian say, lady said, "Let's hear the rubbish." So your Bible is rubbish. Yeah. Oh, that's where my okay, that's okay. Take me what thing, you. Yeah, you speak, man. First thing, no. Wait, no. Don't insult. Right, wrap me up, man. It's not parking. It's okay. going forever, man. Okay. Come on. Listen. No, no, you you said one question. I'm answering okay, your question. You're talking, man. Quiet. You just said one question. Quiet. Quiet. Okay. Okay. Look at these Christians, man. Yeah. You're barking like a dog. You know, he's insulting me in his own language. We love Muslims. I love my Muslim brothers and I pray for them. Just me. This is. This okay. is speaker's corner. You yes. can speak what you want. Okay. You're not the main man here, man. Come on. Said, <laughs> this Christian said, this Christian said that Jesus prayed like us. Why? Yes. Why? Because Jesus, the Christian said, why Jesus prayed like us? Because the Christian said Jesus was like us. So that's why he prayed like us. So. In Philippines chapter you, 2 verse oh 6. No, let me finish. Okay. Now, be Muslim. Did I kick him? What a lie. What a lie. I said this. I'm going to speak no, now. No, yeah. In Philippines chapter 2 verse 6. Christ, who though being in the form of God, humbled himself and okay. became like us. Because he's made like us, we're not going to be an, he's not going to be an atheist, is he? So that's the reason why he prayed. Ah, so Jesus prayed, yeah? Yes, in his, human, in his humanity, yes. And you did earlier on say that Jesus was always God. Yes. And if, if Jesus was always God, does God need to pray? Another I have God. told you. No. I have told you when Christ was in the form of man. Yeah. When Christ was in the form of man, the yeah. divine spirit of Christ yeah. was in it. It dwelt within it. And because Christ came to be a substitute, yeah. he came to represent us. Yeah. So he's not going to go against his own laws. And because he was limited in his human nature, yeah. he had to pray. And he was here to set an example so to, to teach pray. us how to pray. Okay. He had to teach us okay. how to pray. Okay. Let me tell you. Let me, yeah, okay, comment. Done, stop. that's okay. it, bro. I'm done now, mate. No, 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 stay there. You're not letting me ask you a stay question. Stay there. Stay, you spoke. Okay, 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 okay. brother. Okay, hey, listen, okay. In every Christian Bible, in the Old Testament, in the book of the prophet Hosea, in the book of oh, Hosea. God is not a man. That's what he's going to say. Watch. Be, That's uh, what he's going to say. I'll be quiet. <laughs> no, no, but he's misinterpreted. Yeah. Be quiet. Bring it up. Bring it up. Yeah, Go on. Yeah, yeah. Okay. In every Christian Bible, in the Old Testament, in the book of Hosea. Yes. Chapter 11, verse 9. Yes. In the Bible it says, God says, For I am God. Mm. And not a man. Yes, I told you. No, I said, I'm okay. not a man. Who finish sinned. the worst. Finish, okay. finish, okay. finish, finish it. Finish it. Finish it. Finish it. Go on, finish it. Go on, finish the worst okay. up. Finish okay. the worst. Get okay. Hosea okay. and I Okay. Hosea chapter 11 verse 9. It says, God says, For I am God and not a man, the holy one among bring you. Up. Hosea, Hosea. So when. God Here says, is Jesus Christ. Hold on. No, no, no. When, bring, bring Hosea, that worship. Hold on. When God says in the Bible, for yeah. I am God and not a man, 
how can you say? How can you say? Okay, let me give the context stop, behind this. Stop, the context stop, behind stop, this is God is not a man finish. to lie. God is not like a man to change his mind. God is basically saying he is not like a man to change his mind or a man to lie. That's what he's saying. Later on, he did become a man, yes. But this was in the Old Testament before the New Testament began. Okay, is the Old Testament in the Christian Bible. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So what is in the Old Testament do you have to believe? We believe in that verse, brother. I told you God ah. is not a man to lie or to change his mind. Yes, it is basically hey. saying he's not like us because we lie, because yeah. we sin. He's not like us. Ah. It doesn't say he can become it doesn't say he can manifest in human tissue. It doesn't say he can become a man. And when Jesus Christ was on earth, no sin was found upon okay, him. When please, Satan came to okay, Jesus Christ listen, listen, in the wilderness, listen, Jesus defeated every single temptation. Okay, listen, listen, he defeated yeah, every single listen, temptation listen, from the devil, my friend. Listen, in every Christian Bible. All right, that's it, bro. No, I'm, hey, no, stay, bro stay, I'm done. Stay, I've said it so many times, man. Bro, away? because you're not answering my question. Watch the video. I answered like 20 questions in it. Bro, I answered like 20 questions of it. He's not letting me reply. He's not letting me ask him any questions. Done, bro. Watch the video. Watch the video. Watch the video. Watch the video. I'm not going to watch the video. Unless there is a fight. Okay. No, no. Your script has been broken. It's been broken today. He has been broken. Okay. I am concluded because he is not letting me ask any of my questions. I've answered. Like 20 uh, no, of his questions no, gave him these no, explanations. Listen, but Uthman's been coming here for 30 man. years, been holding this folder, are, and so today this clip has been broken. Okay. But as you see, Uthman's heart has been hardened by the devil. So he's not here to listen but to attack on Christianity. Hey, and we abolish every argument that comes against the Lord Jesus Christ, which we have done today. Amen.